Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to another gear review video. It is not raining, but we're talking about these rain trousers or pants for you guys who are American or wherever you say pants. I quite like saying pants, it just feels fun because it's not what we normally do. So these rain pants are what we're talking about today. So these are the Berghaus Pack Light rain pants. Uh, so they're Gore-Tex and basically they're waterproof trousers. So you put them over a pair of trousers that you might be wearing with the idea of staying dry. So I've been using these for the last six months, right throughout our winter season in some rather atrocious weather where I still find myself questioning why I was out in that weather. Um, but they have stood up to the experiences I've put them through and I just wanted to have a bit of a discussion to allow you to make a decision as to whether or not these are the waterproof pants that you need in your life. So let's start right at the beginning. I have used Berghaus in terms of waterproof trouserage for about six, seven years. Um, I had another pair of waterproof trousers by Berghaus that I've used for all of my long distance trails and just basically every day being out and about. Um, and I've upgraded to these guys because they're considerably lighter. So these retail, retail at 110 pounds. I did not pay that, I paid 80, so I'd encourage you to shop around, but they weigh in at 185 grams. Obviously give and take a little bit depending on what size you're getting. For me, these are size small. And yes, these are actually the men's just because they fit better and that's just how I am. Um, so let's just run through the features. So you see they're very simple and that's how they've managed to keep the weight down. So starting from the top up, we have a nice elasticated waist here and that means you can pull these up over as many layers as you want to and just make sure that's nice and snug and you can also tighten it with a little um, like draw cord thingy here on the side and that just makes sure they're not going to fall down which is great no one wants that uh, so then coming down to the side we have these three quarter length zips here which are double access so you can see I've opened them from the top and that just allows for ventilation which is great that's an absolute must for me uh, I tend to find myself feeling quite clammy in waterproofs especially sort of the muggy weather that I'm often walking in being able to open these is fantastic because you then you just straight access to the outdoors um, and then from the bottom access you can unzip them and again that's a must in my world because it means I can pull these on and I can take them off really easily over my boots. Don't need to bother about my boots. Um, I have no stress or struggle trying to get my feet through. It's just whip them on, put them off. So simple as that. So if, you, if you're new looking for a pair of waterproof trousers, I would encourage you to start with a pair that have at least a halfway zip because it really does make all the world a difference just being able to get them on and take them off really quickly. And then you find yourself not necessarily loathing the waterproofing world quite as much. Uh, also at the bottom, we've got some little poppers so we can basically tighten these up around the ankle and just secure in the heat a little bit more and that works quite nicely with gaiters if you're just wanting to keep everything nice and, and tight um, or you know crampons as well you just don't want baggy clothing around so tightening that up just adds to that little bit level of security so they're called the pack light trousers and essentially that's because you get this little mesh pocket thing here which is a little toggle at the top and you can basically roll them up and stuff them in there and that just shows you the pack size so these are really tiny trousers when it comes to packing down they're not gonna you're not gonna have to sacrifice any stackage space in your backpack so it's all good. So that's just a really nice sort of evidence that they pack down small because you get this little mesh bag to come with them. So one thing I want to just consider um, mentioning, or I just want to mention is, actually there's two things. So firstly, if you want pocket access, these are not the trousers for you. There is no access to, to your, your internal pockets of your trousers. So you kind of got to just pop your, your hands down the front and try not to look suspicious. Uh, but that's how you get to your internal pockets, or like that. <laughs> but it's a bit of an ordeal. Um, so that's just one thing to consider. But the other thing is something I'm quite passionate about and it is, it was actually uh, something that I considered um, and that helped me decide to buy these trousers. And basically Burkhaus have teamed up with a company called Blue Sign, which, um, they basically ensure that throughout the entire manufacturing process of a product, right through to the use time, um, there is no, <coughs> there is no, um, issues basically that the product is not going to have any adverse effects in the natural environment so a lot of waterproofing clothing uh, at a microscopic level as it rains the the chemicals leach out and we therefore are quite unintentionally quite often walking through a beautiful pristine or as pristine as it gets natural environment leaching out these chemicals which have adverse effects in the natural environment now you might just say well i'm just one person but if you think about the number of people that walk that trail in, in the year take the west highland way for example 
at least 36,000 people hit that trail each year. Now say 36,000 people's waterproofs leach out a bit of chemical, you get that bioaccumulation in the natural environment and generally that's just not a good thing. So it's really nice to be able to wear and own a pair of waterproofs that you know if it's raining, you don't need to be like, ah, chemicals. Um, it's just a good thing and throughout the entire manufacturing process as well you know none of the the water and the, the again the chemicals used in the manufacture of these are not going to get anywhere near the natural environment it's all disposed of and used safely so if you wanted to be conscious of your environmental impact then i would just consider looking into these trousers and actually have a look at the blue signs website as well i'll pop it in the description below um I'm, I'm quite enthused by them, I must admit. Uh, and I do passionately believe that as outdoorsy people, we should be setting an example about how to respect, protect, conserve, and actually enjoy the, the spaces that we work and play in. So if that's something you are passionate about or you'd like to find out more about, then please do check it out. Take the time to research that and, and build your knowledge up because personally, I think it's very important to set an example. So that's pretty much it. Coming back to the waterproof trousers, that is these guys, Berghaus Pack Light. Couldn't be simpler and I really rather like them. So if you've used them or you've had any experience with them at all or any other waterproofs actually, pop it in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you. And guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, enjoy your adventures and stay wild. <laughs>